exclusive of any one group, age, religion. You know, there, there's a feeling of xenoph like xenophobia. Like, you know, I, I was thinking of history, you know, during World War II, when the Jews tried to get here on the boat called the St. Louis, and they tried to escape Nazi Germany, mm -hmm. and we yeah, sent man. them back uh, for various reasons. There was a lot of anti-Semitism in the country at the time. They felt it was uh, dangerous to do. They, were, they, they couldn't get into Cuba. They couldn't get yeah. into any country. And they all died in concentration camps. And that's history. Mm -hmm. You have got to deal with this type of thing in a humane manner. Manner. These are yeah, children we're talking about. I mean, Chris Christie said he wouldn't even let in orphans, orphans. under five. Orphans. Now, orphans don't eat. How? What are they supposed to do? Are do they you, carrying weapons? And do you know that more than more than half of uh, the state governors don't want these Syrian refugees in? And no. I just think, you know, why should one bad egg ruin it for a bunch? And listen, I've lived this stereotype my entire life. My grandparents immigrated from Lebanon, from the Middle East. I'm half Lebanese. I've heard the names. People People, oh, you're a terrorist, you know, it, like in jest. I, I've lived through that my entire life, so I, I can empathize with this situation. But as you said, we need to be a country of compassion, but we also need to be a country that we have to compromise on this. We need to compromise. We need to ensure to be tougher screening, but at the end of the day, we're a country of immigrants, we also, and we have to be compassionate. We also have to remember, and they said on Facebook, and I love that we get the good Facebook tweets, mm -hmm. and the things that says that Syrian refugees are not the enemy. They are trying to escape the same terrorism. That, that's right. That we're but here. there are going to be a few bad apples, and they need to be vetted, and that's, that's what Homeland Security is for.